every so often one does write a poem that has no personal basis uh, in one's own experience at all. And I can't imagine what led me to write a poem about Victorian or Edwardian love songs. I can't even rem remember wanting to write it or completing it. However, here it is, Love Songs in Age. She kept her songs. They took so little space. The covers pleased her. One bleached from lying in a sunny place. One marked in circles by a vase of water. One mended when a tidy fit had seized her and coloured by her daughter. So they had waited till in widowhood she found them looking for something else and stood relearning how each frank submissive chord had ushered in word after sprawling hyphenated word and the unfailing sense of being young spread out like a spring-woken tree wherein that hidden freshness sung that certainty of time laid up in store as when she played them first but even more the glare of that much mentioned brilliance love broke out to show its bright incipience sailing above still promising to solve and satisfy and set unchangeably in order so to pile them back to cry was hard without lamely admitting how it had not done so then and could not now